TFNN. Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Monday, 10 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes into the trading day, and we got markets hanging around neg negative territory to start things off. Dow Jones right now negative 43 points, trading at 26,368. We got S&Ps negative by three points, trading at 29.03. NASDAQ negative by nine points, trading at 79.75. Quite a weekend. If you didn't check it out, congrats to Tiger Woods grabbing his fifth green jacket at the Masters. Pretty awesome. Got to give it to him for sure. Uh, jumping around to the market. Let's start it off. We'll jump into the futures. Started off with the Dow, and you can see the acceleration. Started at about 7.30 this morning. We make a high of 26,472. We are now trading exactly 100 points below that level, 26,373. NASDAQ 100, the acceleration begins right after the opening bell. We spike higher for a few minutes, up to a high of 76.58. We're now trading 76.41, the NASDAQ 100. S&Ps, pretty similar story. We're trading at about 29.14 on a couple occasions this morning. We're about a point off that level on the open. Currently trading 29.08, looking at that June S&P contract. Excuse me, crude oil with some volatility as well. We're trading at 63.88. We trade down about 50 cents to a low of 63.33 this morning. And then from there, we climb higher. You got crude trading at 63.83. Gold contract, 12.88. We're as low as about 12.85 within the last half hour. And euro US dollar trading basically right at 113 on the dot. In terms of what else you have happening, earnings season in full swing. We got Citigroup, Citigroup earnings beating expectations amid buybacks, but revenues falling. You got Goldman Sachs coming out with their earnings as well, beating analyst estimates for first quarter profit, while markets impacted revenue, revenue being the theme there. To jump over to those two stocks and see how we're trading at this morning, you got Goldman Sachs in negative territory this morning, quite a slide, and as the mark, as we've opened, we've slid even further. We're up to 211.44 pre-market. We're now trading 202.15, down about 2.7%. Citigroup, down about 1.3%, trading at 66.53. In terms of what else you have happening out there, an amusing one, another big night. How about Game of Thrones last night? For people who didn't check it out, but AT&T, what were they doing? Streaming Game of Thrones hours before it was supposed to be on Sunday. Pretty remarkable that an error like that could occur. And who knows if it was an error? I wonder, because they're getting some press. But uh, quite, a, quite a premiere, but nonetheless. Stay tuned, folks. I'm coming back with Larry Pezzavento this hour for the full hour. Have a great Monday.